do you want a speaker with a unique insight into high performance, operational excellence and risk management? Justin Hughes and Jace Hawker are former fighter pilots, Red Arrows pilots and experienced management consultants. We work with clients to help them solve problems, to help them close that execution gap, the gap that exists between the things we want to happen and the outcomes, you know, what actually happens in the real world. So what I want to do this afternoon is to talk a little bit about high performance teams and the pursuits of operational excellence. Imagine losing the most experienced third of your team every year, because that's what happens on the Red Arrows. We have about 100 people on the team. The front end of the 100 is the nine display pilots. Each year of the nine display pilots, the three most experienced pilots leave, and everybody else changes their role within the team, their position in the team. The interesting thing is the team's output every year is always considered to be world class even though it's a different team. We have to be able to reproduce this year on year with different people. What does honesty actually look like? It's about doing what you say you're going to do. It's about putting your hand up if you can't deliver to allow the other people in the team to help you get to where you need to be. And it's about being able to accept constructive criticism from your mates. Because in this world, covering up your mistakes isn't simply a case of protecting your ego or saving a few quid. It can have catastrophic consequences. And what I mean by debrief, it's not just an adverse event. It's about learning from experience. It's an objective assessment of team performance that is jointly carried out and owned by the whole team together with no seniority. How many people say they do that sort of thing? Very few people will feel confident enough to say, yes, I do that. Especially not in front of all your colleagues. <laughs> you put your hand up and they all turn and they go, no, you don't. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> You're a nightmare. People want to win. People want to succeed. They would rather go to work and have a good day at work than have a bad day. When I was leader of the Red Arrows, I didn't see it as my job, really, to motivate people. It was my job to remove all the demotivators to simply allow those people to do a great job. <laughs>